This is an effort by pro-European Union activists to stop the Party of Regions presidential candidate from leaving his hotel in Odessa. Oleg Tasarev, who's from the same party as the ousted president Viktor Yanukovych, was later escorted from the hotel by special forces. Several people were injured during the clashes on Thursday, which followed a rally from pro-Russian demonstrators calling for a referendum on the federalization of Ukraine. In the meantime, in the eastern city of Luhansk, pro-Russian supporters continue their occupation of the Security Service of Ukraine headquarters. The standoff with government authorities is now entering its sixth day. This protester, who wouldn't give her name, said that should the government follow through with threats to clear the building, more protesters would join the barricades. Our children are now working in mines, but when it starts, they will all come here. We'll stay, and if they kill us, let it be. Ukraine's acting president has previously said that activists occupying government buildings wouldn't be prosecuted if they laid down their weapons. Protest leaders have refused.